Hey guys, this is Mary to Be Gaming here. Hopefully, you guys are having a great day. And um, this is my third video that I'm uploading today. Um, so it's pretty insane. Triple uploading. But anyway, guys, I'm bringing back a tutorial video. And this is for educational purposes only. Um, so, yeah. But anyway, guys, this tutorial is going to be basically how to get Minecraft for free. Now, I know that um, the Mine Shafter uh, like, version does not work anymore. Um, if you like if you try to download it um, <clears throat> you know like you go to the launcher and you like launch the game and it says like my chapter error could not do this you know but I'm gonna be showing you guys a legitimate way um, on how to get Minecraft for free and yeah I didn't guys get into it so um, you go into your web browser uh, doesn't matter which one you have I'm using Google Chrome um, so and you want to type in minecraft boss.com I'll have the link down below in the description for you guys so you just click on that and you'll be, um, you'll come into this page, Minecraft Boss download for free, um, play the best sandbox game in the world, and um, just wait for this to load in, and you'll be uh, welcome with these two um, <coughs> uh, links, uh, Minecraft PC slash Mac, Minecraft Pack Edition, you want to select Minecraft PC, PC slash Mac, you want to click on that, it'll bring you guys to this page, just want to scroll down a little bit, keep scrolling, and you're gonna you're gonna um, be open with this um, these two links. Um, the first one will be Windows PC dot exe. Uh, you scroll down a little more. It will say Mac OS download dot jar. And of course, I have the Mac. So you're just gonna click that. You're gonna hit download. And you um, you might be you might come to this page. Just you want to hit redirect me. Don't click on any of this stuff. And this will load up. <coughs> Sorry guys, I'm a little sick. <clears throat> and then you want to hit the download button right under no file preview is available. So just hit download. <clears throat> just wait for it to download. And it only takes about 10 seconds. Um, it, and it's called Minecraft Jar. And you want to hit um, keep. And then you want to just drag it to your desktop. And then you can exit out of your web browser. And now, <clears throat> what you want to do is you want to uh, open up Minecraft one or My Minecraft Jar. And sometimes, if you're on a Mac, it'll say Minecraft Jar cannot be open because it is from an unidentified developer. If that happens, all you do is go to System Preferences, go to Security and Privacy, and then usually it will say Minecraft Jar was blocked from opening because it's not from an identified developer. You just hit click Open anyway. And you hit open. <coughs> Wait for it to load. And they'll say main. Usually, um, if you get the mine shafter version, it says um, bootstrap. Then you're going to be <coughs> welcomed with this um, tab right here. It says an updated version um, for Sky, Sky I don't know how to spell that. Launcher um, version 3.3, but it's compatible on more of your, you know, all that stuff. You basically just want to hit update, and it'll bring you to this page. And you just want to click, um, click to download version 3.100. Just click that, um, and basically you might be welcome with an ad. Basically, you just want to go up to the upper right hand corner and just hit, click skip ad. And then you'll be um, welcome to a mediafire.com. Um, zip. Um, the other link, the other um, page that we were on, you might not get that, but um, yeah, you, you always get this. But so you want to click download, and this will take a little longer than the other thing, um, but uh, yeah, it'll take about one minute. So I'll see you guys when this is downloaded. Okay, guys, it is done downloading. So when it's done downloading, you basically want to drag that to your desktop. You can exit out of your um, web browser, and now you will have these two link or these two um, things on your desktop. If you drag them to your desktop, um, if you did not drag them to your desktop and you just close the web browser, all you and you can't find them, you can't find like these two files. All you do is go to Finder, and then under Favorites, you just click um, Downloads, and they'll be right there. Okay, <coughs> so after you download the file that you just downloaded. Um, the Shigamashima that download zip. You just want to double click it and um, it'll unzip it. And then you'll be welcome with this will be welcome with this folder here and you're just gonna click that. And um, then you'll be welcome with changelog 
dot text, important dot text, OS, um, OSX, and links, um, and then Windows. You just want if you're on Windows, you're gonna hit the, the Windows folder. If you're on Mac or Linux, you're gonna hit the o OSX folder. So you double click that, and then you're gonna be welcome with this tab right here. It says Shinemagamagat um, Launcher Jar. Basically, <clears throat> you're gonna want to drag that to your desktop. You can exit out of that folder. Um, you will not need this folder anymore. Um, so yeah, you can get rid of that. You can also get rid of that zip. And now you have these two files. Basically, you can open either one of them. Um, it's kind of easier just to open the Shigma one. Just open that one. And of course, it will say that sometimes. So you just go system preferences, like I said before, and um, hit open anyway. And hit open. And now, um, it might take a few seconds to load in, but you'll be welcome with uh, the main thing again. So, yeah, there it is. Um, and you will need Java to run this stuff. Um, I will have the Java link in the description below, so you guys don't have to worry about typing that in and everything like that. But um, after you guys um, load in, um, click on that launcher, you're going to be welcome with this, and it's basically a username. Um, you, you can choose any username you want. I have um, Aaron underscore Kim. You can choose any username you want. You don't need to like make an account or anything like that. Just put in a username and, and you hit play. And then you'll be welcome with this. It looks just like the Mind Chapter one, except it's the Shigen Metal Launcher. So um, then um, after that, you can hit Edit Profile if you want to like change your stuff. But I mean, it's basically just set, set stuff right there. And then you just hit play, um, and it will load. Um, and you can play Minecraft, as you guys see in a minute. Um, it will load up. As you can see, Minecraft will load up, and here it is, um, version 1.11, um, and uh, yeah, as you can see, here's Minecraft, everything like that, um, as you can see, all the world, you know, fun, and everything like that, and uh, yeah. Anyway guys, that's the end of the tutorial, if, you, if this helped you guys, please leave a like, um, subscribe, um, if you're new, um, leave comments, if this helped you, also leave a like if it helped you, subscribe if it helped you, do anything if it helped you, and I'll see you guys later.